Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. The Health Ministry is reporting that since the start of the year, 18 babies have died from infections at the University Hospital of the West Indies in St. Andrew and the Cornwall Regional Hospital in St. James. It says the infections are caused by the Klebsiella and the Serratia bacteria. A Tivoli Gardens resident on Tuesday testified that a man with mental illness who was visiting him in May 2010 was killed during a police military operation inside his apartment. Lancelot Bailey also said he watched two JDF soldiers remove the body in one of his bedsheets. Rights group Jamaicans for Justice says Jamaica should accept the UK's offer to help build a prison here. The Jamaican government has been criticized for endorsing the proposed deal. The JTA and school improvement coach Esther Tyson want changes to the teaching and learning process to help more high school students ace the core subjects mathematics and English language. The call follows the release of data from the Education Ministry showing that more than 30 high schools did not record Grade 1 in either CSEC maths or English this year. In sports, former champions Tivoli Gardens have moved up to third in the Red Stripe Premier League standing following their 3-2 victory over host and defending champions Arnett Gardens at the Tony Spaulding Sports Complex on Monday night. In your weather forecast, Wednesday morning will be partly cloudy over northern parishes. In the afternoon, there will be scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms mainly across hilly inland areas and western parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.